up with her best friend. They ordered the most expensive food and drinks. I said I had to use the bathroom. I hoped. To <laughs> what was she thinking? Hey guys, welcome back to Gets It Out. Now today, I have one for you, and I'm actually not shocked. I was going to say I'm shocked that this happened, but I'm not. What happened was this man refused to pay for a woman's date, and she actually put hands on him, fist of cuffs. Now, are you guys shocked? I'm not. Let's get right into this. My date showed up with her best friend. They ordered the most expensive food and drinks. I said I had to use the bathroom. I hope to <laughs> what was she thinking? She showed up to a date with her best friend. If that doesn't tell a man this is a foodie call, I don't know what does. Guys out there, if this happens to you, you already see what's going on on the internet. You know what to do. Daddy's credit card works. People are mad at me for leaving a date who brought her best friend to dinner. Essentially, I had a date plan with one of the girls, and when I arrived, she said her friend was joining us. And when we sat down, they started ordering drinks and appetizers and complimented me the whole time. At this point, I knew this was a scam, and I left. And people are saying that I didn't have a right to leave because those women probably earned triple my wage, and I can't face the embarrassment of not being able to afford cheap drinks. And that poor dude shouldn't date, just stay at home. I don't know. What do you guys think? Yeah, this man did the right thing by getting up and leaving. These ladies look like they run this play twice a week. But unfortunately, this is the play that these women run on beta male guys all the time. And some guys just have the balls to speak up or just hit the side door of the restaurant just like this man did. She won't even say, hey, I'll just cover my part of the tab. Ask my manager. It, you know, it's wild. They did that because they get away with it. There are tons of guys that go through encounters like that and don't do anything. They sit there and pay while they're sitting there talking to each other. He's not even getting any, any conversation from any of them. At least give the man a, a, a special, you know, a special delight where you ladies did what you ladies used to do in college together. I mean, really. All right. I'm not sure about that. Because I'll pay for, I can pay for some of it on my card, but I don't know if I can pay for the rest. Then... Maybe you can do it. Can guys, this is the woman here who go who uses guys for footy calls and she records every date she goes on. I feel like it's a skip, but I have no idea. I can't tell. She does this every on TikTok. She has a whole TikTok channel about this. Do you need have to? Yeah, I don't want. Yeah, I don't mind. This yeah, what she does is I don't I think that'll make sense because um yeah, I don't think I can afford this. Okay, let me just speak with my manager quickly. Okay, cool. Let me know what you can do that. Yeah, let me know what you said. And first off, she's in there filming herself on a first date. That's a red flag. But the dude in there talking about he'll wash the dishes in the back. Most women would have just pulled their card out and paid it. But she want to record the first date and even put this out there to embarrass this guy and actually clown it. These women are not right in the head. And this man would rather wash the dishes than to ask her. You see what happened though is that's this my man dating right here. I, I don't think he realized that she does this. But yes, guys, she actually goes around and records every day she goes on sickening that's all she does is eat food for a living like she was with one guy ate all of his sushi actually i gotta and put that clip in here i reacted to it on my other channel she actually sits there she sat there and ate all of this guy's sushi when he went to the bathroom her to help him pay it that's actually a good man this bill is only 115 and he's telling me to pay for my own food it's and you brought me here. It's only it's only fifty dollars. But so what? It's the point. You brought me here. Why would I pay for my own food? I got money, but now you see the way he said it's only fifty dollars. When he, when he said that, I said, "This doesn't sound like a date." Why would he say to, say to a girl, "It's only fifty dollars"? Does that sound like somebody taking somebody on a date? It's only fifty dollars. Think about that, guys. It's only fifty dollars. It's a three Long Island on here. I didn't even have a Long Island. Okay, but you asked me what do I drink? I didn't know I was paying for my own stuff. 
I mean, I'm, I had the transportation. I might have just paid for my own stuff. I don't even care. I can't believe this, y'all. This is real. Like, this is... He really, I had the transportation he really telling me to pay for... It costs like $30 in gas to come out here. 115 115 And I got to pay for... Now, you notice the man said it cost $30 in gas to come out here, right? Why would a man trying to get a woman talk like this? For my own food. I might as well pay for it all. I want to ask you something. If you went out to eat with a dude, if a dude brought you out to eat, and he said, are you paying for your own stuff, wouldn't you be like... Me, personally, that happened to me before. It happened to me before, too, and it's happening right now. <laughs> so. Um... I'm about to pay the whole thing because it's like, I want you to know that I got money. I mean, that's what you want to do? Just, just, I'll pay the whole thing. Just, are you going to at least thing. tip her? You going to tip her? Bro, I, I told you. I didn't. Y'all, tell me why this dude told me to meet him. No, I got to let y'all know that the guy responded and said they were having a business meeting. I reacted to this. And when he said that, I said, wow, it made sense. Hence why I broke it down that way. At Osaka's at 6, and so like 6.10, I'm like, I'm on my way, but he never texts back. And I get here, he's nowhere to be found. It's 6.50. He was supposed to leave. You're late. And guys, this is how you handle it when women are late for a date. You put your foot down and let them know there will be no disrespect from day one. Really just should have paid for all our food. For one, I'm not paying for everybody's Even food. It's your birthday, birthday cool, but food. I'm not doing that. It's 18. <sighs> this is old. I second this man's decision. When you see, and because even recently there was another guy who went out with a group of people that had been 10 to 18 of them, and he paid for his bill ahead of time to avoid situations like this. He's out with his girlfriends. So he, not his girlfriend, but her girlfriends. There could be other guys there. The guys are probably eating responsibly, ordering things they can afford, ordering things that don't cost too much. Them over here, they're ordering whatever they want. Whatever They're ordering with their eyes, not with their wallets. Why, why do you got to pay for all y'all food, though? You brought 18 friends. I'm going to leave you. You been here with them or you coming with me? Are you? bro! Man, they, guys aren't going for it. I, I love seeing stuff like this, right? Women do this every state, right? You see this one here is in Atlanta. The other video could have been, I don't know. I don't know where it was, but it could have been Chicago. It could have been anywhere. Seattle, could, anywhere. Why do they think men just want to pay for food? And then guys are paying for food and not getting anywhere. And you not gonna pay. What you mean? What is going on? He invited me out. You invited me out and you can't pay? What you mean? Now, see, in her defense, I gotta say something. If a man invites a woman out, and I, I, even if he's not getting anywhere, he sees it's not going to go anywhere. I may get killed for this in the comments. I think the man should pay. That's just that's just my take on it. I wouldn't have invited her out. Eating my dinner. The, so that means what? You do not keep your word, right? I do that, keep my word. Keep How do word. I? If I didn't keep my word, why would? This woman goes off a of man she's seeing after he failed to take her to Capital Grill restaurant and prepared. A home cooked meal instead. If I didn't keep no, my word, how would you? If you don't I have it, meal? just say you don't have it. I absolutely and have it. Actually, tell me and have me expect maybe, okay, I don't have it at all. I mean, put something cute for her. She might like it. No, but you you had to come over here expecting we're going somewhere and we're not actually going. I don't like that. I don't. I can have Zoom over me that to be. No. Well, guess no. what? Guess what? No, You're with I, me right I, now, okay? I'm with you right you, now. Yes, we're on not, a day. Hold up. She's mad at him? This was the surprise. <laughs> he wanted to prove that he can cook. It's, it's wild because before I got my, well, my wife, I would do stuff like this. The man wanted to show you he can throw down. She doesn't realize he's showing, look, if you're with me, 
sometimes I'll cook. As women like to say, men want to go 50-50, but they won't tolerate when a man's not doing 50% of everything. He's willing to do 50% of everything. Right now, exactly. they didn't I'm make the cut, right and now, I did. Right? I'm a true they right must have not did something right. Me, I never, I didn't lie to you about anything. Yes, you did. No, you I talk, didn't. You told me we were going to the Capitol Grill. Are and we were going to the Capitol Grill, but I decided to cook you this time. I need you to stick by your word. I, and I no, do. You're not. I always no, you're stick not. by my word. No, you're not. No, no, you are not. You were just over here complaining. You haven't even had one bite of this food. I don't want to have you one. haven't even, you haven't even taken one expected, bite out of it. I expected to have wow. more. Wow. I expected more. You shouldn't yeah. be expecting stuff so early on. I, you shouldn't be lying to me so early on. I don't, I didn't lie, I didn't lie to you. You shouldn't be lying I didn't, to me so early on. I, I didn't lie about you know, anything. I'm here for a reason, right? This is the second day. I'm here for a reason, right? I'm you, here for a reason, yeah, right? Because okay, you want so to be here. I expect to go to the Capitol to grill. Okay, I want to wow. go out. I want to stay in. Okay, you should have told me that. You should communicate. I communicated I mean, like with men you. Like too, like these guys exactly. don't communicate. Y'all want to say that y'all have so much y'all drunk. I can really like pull up and take you me to go. Well, that, why don't you go with them then? Okay. Why don't you go with them? You're right. Since, since they are so much better than me, then why don't you go with them? Better, yeah. like, they're keeping the stack and you keeping the zero. That's I kept it. Is. I kept it. This, this is my house. I own this house. Okay. okay? Uh, you, you own house? Yes. You I own, own this house. house. Congratulations. Yes. You thank you. And so I decided to. If you decide own to... a house, you can keep your word too. I absolutely can. So like you sign the lease of mortgage, you can. You are ungrateful. Job, you are you ungrateful. I'm not ungrateful. You're ungrateful. You are ungrateful. I didn't lie. I ain't lie about nothing. You're ungrateful. Your boss. You fucking. Forget it. Just, okay. you know what? Yeah, just forget it. Just okay. give me my food back. Uh, yeah, give me my food Here. back. I will cook it for food. another woman. Then she will be appreciative. Because uh, you know what? You ain't the woman for me. Right. I'm going to have to be right Yeah, now. yeah. You yeah. do that. You do okay. that. Guys, remember, if you have to take these women out, just take them on a coffee date. If she's truly into you, she will come to the coffee date. If she's not, she's not going to come. I think that's a good thing to be able to evaluate certain women that you shouldn't even put your time into. Only date women who are into you. We've been telling you guys for the last two years to not even deal with ungrateful modern women. Use your passport. Go overseas to date traditional foreign women. And that traditional part is important. But that's all I got in this video. You guys drop a comment down. And guys, I just got to finish this with saying I actually second that. <laughs> I second it because... Me, myself, I myself am a passport bro. My wife is a Filipina. I've been out of the country. She's, she's, <laughs> she's right here. I've been out of the country for 10 years. And I'm, I'm the happiest man that you'll, that you'll find around, right? I've never been as happy. Actually, I slowed down my aging. Since I've left, I'm not really aging much. And I've been out here for 10 years. So if, if I can do it, you can do it too. Thank y'all for watching. Uh, before you go, I ask you to be sure that you like, comment, subscribe. Also, smash that notification bell just to be sure you get on my videos as soon as I release them, you know, so you get them right away. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. See you next time. Peace. Baby, you give me ice and fire.